Good morning, Math 3 students. This is your week five, lesson three, and it's on trig graph matching. So you might be thinking, all right, we have done a lot of graphing and a lot of equation writing, and you're absolutely right. So today's practice on Delta Math will have you matching a graph with a specific equation. So just a quick reminder on our formulas that we've been using. So the format for transformations of sine and cosine functions y equals a times the sine or cosine of bx plus d. Once again, where d is the midline, where a is the amplitude, where b is always 2 pi divided by the period because it has to do with the frequency. And keeping in mind that if at the midline on the y-axis we're starting on a hill or a valley, so we're above or below the midline, that's definitely a cosine function. But if on the y-axis, the graph is actually starting right on the midline, which means we're halfway between the peak and the valley, then you know that that is a sine function. So head on over to Delta Math, try out those practice problems, and good luck out there.